Sophomore design is what this class mirrors over at the universities. Essentially, everyone's going to take 150, and then to the next level, you're going to take a specialty-driven, essentially design-based course. This is it, okay? So over there, you use two different softwares. You use Creo or you use SolidWorks, okay? We have the luxury of using both. Um, I've used both. Creo is more um, conceptual. Meaning for you to draw a box, you have to put in four different origin types. Um, extrude that out on a different origin. Um, all while establishing that. We, we just want to draw a cube. Okay? In SolidWorks, it enables you to do that without any really issue. And you can focus more on the design aspect than you can clicking buttons and trying to worry about manipulating the software. Okay? Second part about it is, is that since this is sophomore design, it's really, really important... Because you have to actually learn this and apply these concepts. Because if you don't learn how to use SolidWorks and you don't learn how to use gears and you don't know how to make an assembly and have all this stuff come together, day one, when you walk into junior design, sophomore and then junior after you transfer, you're going to be lost. Day one, they're going to say, you need to do this, this, and this. And if you don't have an idea what's going on, you're already behind. Because you better believe everyone else is going to know what they're doing. Okay? So really keep that um, line of thinking with you when you're going through all these activities with these softwares and things are doing like this like you're going to use this pretty much forever in time in some aspect right as a mechanical engineer you're always going to be with three-dimensional objects they're always going to be coming in some fashion together with motion all that beautiful things okay so this isn't a lost effort okay so i just can't emphasize that enough to keep that in mind and to anything take notes you know make use of this so when you come back to it you're still familiar with that hope this helps